The Indian Navy has decided to shift from Ukrainian gas turbine engines to indigenous marine gas turbine engines to power small and medium class warships. The Indian Navy has started talks with Indian industrial partners that will be roped in to develop small to medium class marine engines in the country. The RDO has revived work on the Cavalry Marine Gas Turbine engine that will have an improved modified core that can sustain 12 megawatt power for longer durations. The DRDO is also planning to develop a marine engine that will be based on the 120 kN class engine that will be developed jointly with a foreign partner for the AMCA program. Japan is developing XF9 engine with 147 kN of wet thrust, but it still went back to Rolls-Royce to develop a new engine to power the joint 6th generation fighter jet program being developed by UK Italy and Japan by 2035. Instead of developing a new engine based on the 40-year-old Safran M88 engine or General Electric F414, India could have received the latest next-generation jet engine for the AMCA from the Tempest program, that can also support future power needs for sixth-generation fighter program, and the adoption of directed energy weapons that require immense power generation requirements. The DRDO has developed a 25 kg drone that can be attached with a machine gun to hit targets with high precision and can also carry around 150 rounds. The RDO officials have said that the technology demonstrator equipped with laser range finder has successfully carried out firing demonstration, during which it showed little recoil. Further development of the drone will be carried out with more sensors to provide better target recognition and improve its accuracy in long distance. On the inaugural day of Aero India 2023 in Bengaluru, Prime Minister Modi will inaugurate a new Hindustan Aeronautics Helicopter Manufacturing Unit in the Tumkur district. The helicopter factory spans over 615 acres and has completed final assembly line facilities flight hangar air traffic control and other facilities and is ready to begin phase 1 operations to manufacture light utility helicopters as well as Indian multi-role helicopters in the future. Due to an embargo by European Union government on the sale of military items to China, Pakistan Navy will receive the first Chinese-built Yuan-class submarines equipped with Chinese CHD-620 engine, which is a copy of the German MTU-396. Thailand Navy had ordered the same Yuan-class submarine from China, but it is now refusing to accept delivery, if it does not include the original German engine as the Chinese engine have higher noise levels. A contingent of the Indian Air Force comprising of four Su-30 fighter jets, two C-17 and one IL-78 aircraft will arrive at Japan's Hayakuria base to conduct the first bilateral air exercise with Japan Air Self-Defense Force from 12th to 26th January. The inaugural exercise will include the conduct of various aerial combat drills between the two air forces and will undertake multi-domain air combat missions in a complex environment and will exchange best practices.